please subscribe and you can download this code from description below. Pparsing is a powerful Python library for creating parsers. It provides a simple and flexible way to define grammars directly in Python code, making it easier to parse complex data formats or languages. This tutorial will introduce you to the basics of pparsing and guide you through creating a simple parser with code examples. Before we start, make sure you have pparsing installed. You can install it using pip. In pparsing, everything you want to parse is represented as a token. Tokens can be simple strings, regular expressions, or more complex constructs. A grammar is a set of rules that define the structure of the language or data format you want to parse. Pparsing allows you to express these rules directly in Python code. A parser is an object that uses a grammar to analyze input and produce a structured result. Pparsing parsers can generate parse trees or return simple data structures. Let's create a simple parser that can recognize and parse basic arithmetic expressions. In this example, we define basic tokens for integers and operators. We then use the operator precedence function to define the grammar for arithmetic expressions. Finally, we parse an input expression and print the result. Pparsing allows you to customize parsers for specific needs. Let's extend our example to handle parentheses in expressions. Now, our parser can handle expressions with parentheses. We use the group class to create a new grouping token that includes expressions inside parentheses. Pparsing is a versatile library for building parsers in Python. This tutorial covered the basics of creating a simple parser for arithmetic expressions and demonstrated how to customize parsers for specific needs. As you become more familiar with pparsing, you can explore its advanced features for handling more complex grammars and data formats. ChatGPT